Uh, thank you, everyone, for coming. Um, I have to just do a few housekeeping points before we go any further, so I'll do this quickly. Um, I'm Caroline Harper. I'm the he head of the social development program here at ODI. Um, first of all, this event is on the record and it's also being streamed online. So we have online uh, people watching. So welcome to everyone who's watching online. And we will also, at the end of the session, be taking questions from people online if you want to ask them. Um, on the uh, fire alarm, if it sounds, you came in through the exit and that's where you go. Um, and after the, uh, I think we have <coughs> maybe outside, there are some publications related to the event. So um, if you want to pick those up on your way out, um, please do so. Um, for the speakers, the only housekeeping is that you must speak into the microphone so that people online can hear you. Um, and so make sure that you're doing that also when you're answering questions. Um, so let me introduce the panel that we have here. Um, at the far end, I have Georgia, who um, has worked on the report. She's an independent consultant working on sexual and reproductive health issues, women's economic empowerment and gender, and has also worked in DFID. Um, online, we have Paula, who is a uh, research fellow in the social development program, um, and she is also an author of the report. She's been working, um, carrying out policy research evaluation and capacity building work um, for our program and prior to that, um, working also as an economist, um, as a freelancer. Um, Zoe? On my right is an evaluation advisor with the UK's Department for International Development, and she works to evaluate gender-related programs, amongst other activities, especially those focusing on the economic empowerment of women and girls and preventing violence against women and girls. And Jonathan, um, on my left here, um, as he puts it, he ran away from ODI two years ago, mm -hmm. but he now misses it a lot, which we're very <laughs> pleased to hear. Um, but he works... Um, for Coffee International um, and leads the economic growth practice within Coffee. Um, prior to that, he worked at ODI and created the private sector and markets program for seven years. So, welcome to everyone on our panel and Paola online. Um, and uh, we will start, I think, with our presentation. 